Hey folks, Thirsty Panda here. Today we're going to be checking out a Schwarzbier. Ah, wunderbar, Schwarzbier. Yeah, good, good, good beer. Anyway, uh, this is a roasted coconut black lager. There we go. I guess this is my uh, tribute to uh, Hogan's Heroes today. Anyway, this is a seasonal beer, small batch uh, beer. They're about six so on the ABV and 32 on the IBU and I'll let you know if it's okay. So let's crack this bad boy open. Uh, Fieldhouse is just one of those uh, local phenoms. Uh, they're doing really really well. Uh, really catering to our uh, local beer scene. Uh, it's a hipster joint. Kind of nice place to go. They actually got some good food there. They do concerts and all sorts of cool stuff. Anyway let's uh, See what we got. So we got under the hood. So we're here for the beer. It's all about the beer. And I do. Whoa. Whoa, look at that bad boy. Wow. When they say a black lager boy, they are not messing around, that's for sure. Wow, look at that, eh? Wow. I think I'm drinking a stout or something without the uh, without the nice foam. Anyway, let's see what we got. Hmm. Wow, it's uh, it's a really strong, strong deep uh, sense to it. You wouldn't think you're drinking a lager, but then again, uh, there's only two types of beer: there's lagers and there's ales. That's it. Uh, within them, they have a multitude of variations, but uh, and this is brewed in a lager style, so with a, a top fermenting yeast. Hmm. Well, let's give her a taste. I'm almost, I'm almost scared. I don't scare easy. Wow, chocolate. It's like it's like chewing on a chocolate bar. Wow. Deep coffee. You pick up the coconut, but it's not really it's not overly dominant, like but it's yeah, this is more like a more like a, a stout uh, in 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 flavor and in texture very dark coffee uh, chocolatey rich uh, flavors to it uh, certainly not something you're just gonna you know bring to the beach that's for sure well it's got the even though the alcohol is a little lot higher uh, it doesn't uh, you don't pick up on that as much but uh, you're 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 feeling the, the deep malty rich uh, rich flavors this is a really nice beer really different yeah, definitely different. So, yeah, no, if that's what you're looking for, something maybe a, a nice sipping beverage, something to something to enjoy uh, uh, over a period of time. Uh, yeah, definitely a good choice. That's for sure. Yeah. So again, this is the uh, seasonal. It's a seasonal beer, so you're not going to be able to get this for much longer. It's their toasted uh, coconut black lager from Fieldhouse Brewing. So uh, yeah, cheers. And, uh, stay thirsty. I'm sure thirsty. Hey folks, just a little update on that video that you just watched. I guess you're still watching it, really. So I pop into Fieldhouse and I fill up a growler with the toasted coconut black lager because I thought it was pretty good and I thought it'd be a nice festive drink to share with the uh, Angry Rob, Captain Angry Rob. And the first thing I really noticed right off the bat out of a, a keg version of this product was the coconut. It was like, wow, hey, that's really there. It's not something I picked up on out of the bottle. So there you go. So if you if you try a beverage out of a bottle, if you ever get the chance, you know, go to the, the actual brewery and try it out of, out of keg product. I mean, it's the difference between draft and bottle, right? There's definitely a difference. But this one was noticeable. There was a real, real noticeable difference. So anyway, cheers. Feliz Navidad. Enjoy.